Come on, come on, come on, come in that water. There we go. What is up with this game and dead cats? Mm. Oh my god, these hacks. Oh wow, I did it first go. <laughs> Let's see if this works. You know, if I stand still for long enough, I go invisible. Still a 
Delta. The tour was never the same without you. And to think oh, that you were so easy, spliced actually. you couldn't stand when we stuck you into that get-up. The Fontaine family retirement plan suits you to a T, my boy. Out of browsing Reddit. Is there any decent new videos on? I don't know. I don't go to the videos tab often. I just go on like the first three pages of the front page mm -hmm. and then. And then that's it. Uh, and then the board of the internet. Are you? Have you still got that while I'm sitting there? Like you just pulled her over to still. No, oh, I actually don't get bored when I'm not on a computer and just doing something randomly. Yeah. But the second I get back on the computer, I just get bored right away. Wow. Man, like I've said, if you had a decent computer and you know you could get on Battlefield, I don't understand how you get bored of that. <clears throat> or CSS. Thinking about. I would honestly so I get money for Christmas I'm not to get funny. CSS. Just tell, tell your mom I've saved up three hundred dollars. Can I just have money and I'll buy my own computer? Severance package cancelled. Benefits, benefits rescinded. I, I. He doesn't know I have the three hundred. All oh, right. Can you not tell her what she? Then she's gonna away? ask. She'll just ask me for some. Oh <laughs> shit! <laughs> just because I was little, I used to always give her money. I used to always give her pretty much all the amount of money I ever got when I was little. Oh, so she owes you then. She, uh, she owes you Devin Hernandez Lopez Ramirez. Our hope was to bond a little sister to a single protector, so she had to be expendable in case of error. As we were fabricating a father bond, we couldn't really afford to have the girl's parents asking around. So, Fontaine's orphanages provided, and the procedure was an unprecedented success. If I had only known who the child was, Eleanor, I'm so sorry. Oh, careful hacker. Nice. Do you think scarier doing a roll in on the thing or dropping in? Roll ins are easy. Well, I say they're easy. There was one of that flow skate park we went to <clears throat> that's like near enough vertical. Like, you know, when you roll over it, you've got like a foot of it and then it goes curves down because they've not got that much space. So instead of making it like a really long slope, they've just done a really steep one so you get the same speed. I don't know. I'd say dropping in still, though, definitely, even on vert. You think it's scarier? Yeah. I mean, I'm not scared now. I'm not scared of dropping on anything, but you know how the two answer dropping it. If you've never done vert, you know, like in your case. <clears throat> I, I was scary. trying to get my friend Spencer up in, you know, but he, yeah. like, because he doesn't really ride skateboards often. So we're kind of just, like, teaching him. So, <clears throat> he was sitting there, and, like, he was, like, for some reason, we were skating, like, 10 hours, I think. Yeah. Like, we went left at 12 and we're skating all day, went to the skate park at like 6 and stayed till about 9. Wait, do you have lights at that park? Yeah. Oh, sick, man. We don't get any of that shit here. That costs money. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, that costs money. There's only two skate parks here that have lights. Oh. And there's like 12 skate parks all together, though. But, and the, one of the main skate parks that like, my brother bikes at, you know? That one I was telling you, it's mainly like a biking one. They're redoing it and adding a bunch of things for skateboarders now. Oh, nice. But there was a big grass patch where there used to be benches and they took out all the benches because no one ever sat on them. And are putting a bunch of different things like they put a couple boxes. They put like a floor set. And then have a rail going down there. I don't know. Anyways, I was trying to get my friend to drop in and he was getting so close like he'd get his tail on and just sit there for a little bit, you know? 
And like he never rides skateboard, so it's kind of like surprising that he's actually like thinking about to trying. Pump, by the way, I would suggest you start him off yeah. and pumping and put down first so he gets feel the transition. We taught him how to. Well, I did on that same day before we went to the skate park and the ditch. We were just oh, skating nice. in the ditch. I was teaching him how to pump going up and down that. But he was afraid to do a rolling thing. Or, no, I mean, he only wants to do a rolling thing. And there's a slope that's, like, not really steep mm. at all. It's, like, barely steep. But he wouldn't drop in on it. He'd just roll into it. I was trying so hard just to get him to try to drop in on it. Yeah, it's just But he was like, Cause I just don't like... He was like, I just don't like dropping in. And I was like, you've never tried it. He's oh, I already know I don't like it, though. <laughs> I was like, come on, Spencer. It's so fun. When I had my first trade for that day. Did you have? Oh, nice. Plant on the front. <laughs> Those are the board. Hold on, I'm stuck in the toilet at the moment. One second. God, the amount of enemies. Christ. Sure you're fair enough there at the game. Fuck just shot me there. What I'm gonna do, you know, when we go this Sunday, I'm gonna I'm gonna take my phone and I'll get some footage. I was like rolling around, I'll send it to you, you know, on WhatsApp, so you can have a look. Alright. <coughs> I was to be Sophia Lamb's greatest achievement, a living composite of all Rapture's genius and the body of a single man, unfettered by self-interest. Now I am nothing more to her than a experiment. My scores on tests of intelligence and moral reasoning are still noteworthy, but declining sharply. She has abandoned me, and I do not have long before psychosis takes me. Right, one sec. I'm just going to quickly go and get something to drink. I'm fucking dying here. One sec, there I'll be.
Blanco next to you there. Yep. Blanco boy. What are you kidding me, man? You know what, what, what phone have you got? Have you got a proper phone or have you got like an old phone? Oh, that's one thing you can ask for. Ah, oh, never mind then. You've got a proper phone. Does your iPhone, when you get like three percent or lower battery, does it stay at three percent right? Mine, the battery's good on it, and it's been at three percent battery for I'm not exaggerating about the last six hours, and I've got Wi-Fi, 3G, everything turned on. You know to try and drain it, so I can charge it now overnight, yeah. and it's still on three percent. Like it, it's, I don't know what's wrong with it. It's still turned on. My phone. My phone doesn't make a difference if I have my internet turned on or anything. God, what a piece of shit. Even the battery doesn't drain right. That French bastard. My phone. I charge my phone like once every two days. That's because I never use it. Just sits there most time. Oh, shit. God, I hate this fucking hacking sometimes. There we go, that's better. Ouch! Where the fuck did you come from? Bastard. What the fuck, man? Just came out of nowhere at me. French bastard. Man, you know that curry I had today? I put so much garlic in it. Good God. Is there a Stanley lot of garlic and Mexican food, terrible. by the way? What? Is there a lot of garlic and Mexican food? As I recall from my time doing no. business with the owners, that oxyfil station out there is just a front for a kind of hidden passage leading down. I love garlic, though. If Lance mm. hiding Eleanor from you, that's where she'll be. I put loads of garlic in everything I make. I love it, I do. We're loving it, loving it, loving it. We're loving it like that. Uh, do you really like it? Is it, is it wicked? God, wow, nice. This place is fucking pitch black. I'm afraid the lights in here sting my eyes terribly now. Until you arrive to deal with me, they will remain off. Please, locate the breakers and flip them, and then return here to restore power. Find and activate the circuit breakers. How many have I got? Two.
Ah, itchy ear, shit. Random itchy ear attack. Oh my god, come on. I tell you what, my hands are starting to go cold now. Jesus. Dr. Alexander has agreed to accept both measures of the new utopian project. He will become a kind of genetic chimera, host to all the minds of Rapture, accessing their talents and memories via the Adam we have gathered. And deriving in part from Project WYK, I have developed a new set of behavioral constraints. Dr. Alexander will live to promote the common good. His love and loyalty shall be spread evenly across the entire human race. For me, that is discipline at great personal cost. For him, at last, it will be instinct. Sophia believes the perfect human altruist is just a formula waiting on us to solve for X. Intelligence and consciousness are not the same, she argued. Awareness of self naturally becomes obsession with it. So, if we could suppress my sense of self, but imbue me with the cognitive capacity to serve the common welfare, we could thereby generate... Oh shit, utopia. I forgot to tell you, I've got one of those uh, Hearthstone keys. Last, utopia would follow. Got one? Yeah, I finally got one in the mail, but you're not going to believe this, I've put it on eBay. Because you know, I was after one for ages. I've lost interest <laughs> in the game now. I got the key and I was like, oh wow, I forgot I signed up for this. eBay time? <laughs> <laughs> I put on for three days and see how it do, or see how it does rather. How much are you trying to sell it for? I don't know. I think they sell for around ten, well, ten, fifteen pounds here in the UK. So I don't know. It's about fifteen, twenty dollars. So it's not too bad. I've got, I think, two and a half days left on it though. It's an EU key. Oh man, I'm so tired. I fucking hope Dan gets on. And I knew that to create the first true utopian would come at a high cost, my friend. We needed someone to be host to all that Adam, Rapture's finest minds. A willing subject, that is to say, myself. Do you want to turn the lights on now for me, please? Thank you. Oh. <laughs> Dove. Whatever oh. you may have seen inside the tank, that was indeed me. 
I fear the fate of Eleanor Lamb will be less physical, but no less grotesque. This tank for deep sea life is the ideal way to dispose of me. But first, you must retrieve enough adamant-fused plant life to lure me out. The slugs feed on the stuff, and it's all I seem to want now. I have left a sample here, so you know what to look for. Okay, four item infused. Okay. I see you out there, Delta. You want to be top man? You want to sit in the big chair? Well, come and take it. Oh, sh shit. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck me, Devin. What? Oh, God. Oh, God. Daddy, no. What is that? That's after you. Oh, oh my. That's, uh, that's the big daddies. Do you remember from the old one? And the dude, the yeah. Drill is actually, the drill is way overpowered. I've leveled it up full. So it's not actually too bad. Well, listen, son. Those override keys you've been hunting are genetically encoded. And to get to Eleanor, you're going to need one from Alex the Great in there. First things first, we got to pin him down. Find those plants he mentioned and lure him back out. Do you really like it? Is it, is it wicked? We're loving it, loving it, loving it. We're loving it like a that. Uh, have you heard that song, Dev? No, actually, I have oh, not. Oh, Devin Blanco. The Blanconator. Oh, there's no <laughs> good things here. You don't have to laugh when I call you the Blanconator, by the way. It sounds really forced. You know, like you feel sorry for me, but like a three-legged dog. Or do you actually like? Yeah. Do you like? Do you like being called the Blanconator? Is that like a superhero for you, though? I don't care what you call me. I don't care what anyone <laughs> calls me. She... There is literally nothing good to buy here. Ooh, electrical storm. Ah, never mind. Yeah, nothing to buy again. We're loving it, loving it, loving it. We're loving it like that. Man, this game is just throwing stuff at me now. <laughs> oh, Houdini's done. Alpha's not done yet. I fucking missed. God, man, I'm getting fucked off with this hacking now, I'm not gonna lie. Jesus. <laughs> oh, God. Let's 
better. Have you had dinner yet, Devin, or have you just got that food and will that do you for a bit? You know that thing. It's only yeah, it's only three thirty. Oh, that's not too bad. Are you going out skating or are you just staying and doing your work? I'm staying in. So does Spencer and everyone else go to the normal school then? You're the one that does that yeah. in home one. Actually, Spencer's gonna start doing this one after the end of this semester. Starting Why? next semester. Because I don't know, actually. <laughs> <laughs> because <laughs> be honest. Shit, man, I'm in the chambers. I'm in the oh god. I'm getting gas like the Jews. I can't move. some splicer manages to kill off their sister. And then if the coma doesn't take them, they turn maniac. Nothing left to do but scream. Uh, no offense intended, son. We better get you to Eleanor on the double. Your body begins to tear itself apart. The compulsion to find Eleanor will drive you to madness or coma. You have no claim on her. Your design was among Rapture's greatest sins. And yet, you persist. Why? Well, that's the end of the Alpha series. The pair bond simply worked too well. That madwoman Tannenbaum bit the company hand, turning some of the bonded sisters human again. Others were lost to splices. Either way, the trauma proved too much for the bonded protectors resulting in unreasoning rage or coma. We can harness their suicidal aggression as foot soldiers, but no more, I'm afraid. Today, I saw one kneeling near a gatherer's garden and crying.
Retarded. I'm setting my own fucking tourists on line. On fire, I mean. On high. <laughs> I've just killed my own tourists. Oh my god. That. I dropped nail clipper. I was just messing around with them, flinging them around. Instead of messing around, do you want to maybe cut your nails? I don't need to cut my nails. Maybe you need to cut your nails. I do. You're right. They're not very long, actually. But I hate having, you know, like, you know, when I like have my hands like this and I run my thumb over my middle finger. You know, you can feel the name. I hate having that. They're hard to cut when they're short, so I need to let them grab it and then cut them because it's hard to get underneath them, you know, with the nail clippers. God, loads of my mates bite their nails, man. It's fucking disgusting. Ugh. Like wild animals. Like wild animals, they are. Jimmy Devy Cakes. No. I was watching a video. <laughs> Go ahead, tell me again. Go. What video was it? I don't know. It was like a woman finds out how difficult it is to live in a man's world. Ah. Not a very good one. I started and I couldn't even continue watching it. Let's just join. Hello. Hello. Good evening, Matthew. How you doing? It's me. Good. Yeah. Yeah, not too bad, mate. Uh, is all those lot gone bed now? Because I need to talk to you about something. Yeah, they went a while ago. Did they? Just, oh, oh. Right. You know, Emma came down. Me and her spoke a couple of days ago after your birthday. And is this true that Carl and Ian didn't even bother going out? Not even just to see you on your birthday. Oh, how you doing, no. Arrow? Wow, I'm not being funny. I thought she was taking the piss. Are you kidding me? No. Tell me that. I said to him, like, they can come if you want. I'll bother if you don't. And then Liam was like, yeah, I don't really want to go because he doesn't like going out. And Carl. Yeah, but just, you again, know, once. I don't know if he, he was going out, but I know. If I'd said, oh, let's go for. Fuck. You know, go out for tea or something. Yeah. Said, yeah. But we always go out for tea. I know, but, oh my god, just, you know, not even once, even just to go back at, you know, like yeah. 10 or 11, 
Good God, yeah, they could have just come. Fake. I'm sorry, I just can't get over it. I thought she was taking the piss. That's how I just don't bother with him anymore. Fucking hell. You know, so just have courtesy though. Like, I mean, I don't one. like, like for example, you know, I don't like fish food that much. But you know, if we go out to a restaurant, they order, order fish or whatever, or if someone buys me, you know, like a uh, cod or whatever, I'll still eat it. Yeah. Fucking hell, man. Oh, fuck you. Well, it's like, hey, for Carl's birthday, they went to Nando's. I went with them. I've never been to Nando's bar before, and I was pretty damn I certain that I would not like it because it's like, it's yeah, flavorful Nando's chicken in it. Nando's. Did you not like it? Well, I had like the least flavorful chicken, and it was really? okay. Yeah. But I haven't even tried it because it, it, it was Carl's birthday. Any other day, I would have said no. Because yeah. I probably won't like it, it's a waste of money. But it was Carl's birthday, I was like, it's a bit expensive, but you know, I'll go for the birthday. Well, Nando's isn't too bad, it depends what you get. Usually, if there's like a big group yeah. of you, well, there's a lot of discount habits, cards and whatnot. Oh, yeah, yeah. You should have got like a platter or something. I'll let you know about it. Brad. Uh, yeah, sorry, Arrow, yeah, I'm alright. Sorry, I keep forgetting checking chat, man. I'm playing this half asleep. But yeah, you went out on, on Carl's birthday, was it, or something? Yeah. That was like back in March, April. Shit, Can't remember when this birthday was. I don't know anymore, mate. Uh, like I said, I wouldn't even bother personally. I just didn't see the point in making an argument about him. I just said if you don't come, I don't mind. Because like last year, I don't think you I care anymore, with... do you? Really? Let's be realistic no, I don't. here. Because last time, last year, obviously Emma, we didn't. Brad, Brad too didn't know Emma, and you know yeah. she didn't live there. So it was just me and Brad and Johnny who went out and. This other girl who was friends with us, Helen, who used yeah. to go at nights out with. I was supposed to be going to Manchester. I thought, go to Manchester and, you know, have quite a few of us and stay over in the Penny Inn. Mm. Like Brad and Carl and that come. And Carl was up for it. Uh, I can't remember what Liam said. Ow, fuck me. But Brad was like, no, I'm not going to Manchester. I'm not going to Manchester. Why? I was like, why? Because, like, you know, because there's like. Manchester's one of the Something places like there's lots of full, like, thieves and books and stuff. And I'm like, Every time, you know, every time you tell me these stories, it just sounds like excuses, like, oh, I'm it not, is. I'm not going to see you because it's just too far, and I can't be asked. blah, 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 it's just, you know, crying. That's all I hear, I just hear, where, where? I still had a good night for the last year, but I, w I really wanted to try it Manchester. I thought, yeah. I'd get a few of us stay You've been Manchester around here, cheap. I loved it when I went. Not yet, no. Have you not? You've not I even been I still really want to go, I've not been yet. The problem is, over Christmas, it's expensive for a room. Oh, yeah. So, um, as soon as I see it's cheap for a room, I'll be like, right, then let's go. Yeah, go. Man, even if you're going with Emma and Brad, they're still alright, but aren't they? I mean, I'm not going out with them, obviously. Yeah. Yeah. Mate, I'm just I mean, wondering... Liverpool's good. You know, like, Carl and Liam didn't go. I, I'm willing to bet money, because I've been out all last week, but I'm willing to bet they came on here and played Team... No, what is it called? Like League Legends. of Legends. Yeah. yeah. And did they, do you know, did they tell you? Did they tell me what, what they like did? did? Yeah, did you ask them? Didn't know. I, I pretty much knew. Liam would have been on his computer, because yeah. he doesn't do anything else. And Carl, unless he was out with his uni mates, how they doubt it, but... I'm surprised he actually goes out, does he go out with them, then and does he do what you, you all do? Goes, goes no, he doesn't go clubbing with them, but he'll, he'll go fight food with them, and mm. just chill with them in their flower. He doesn't, they don't go around, he doesn't go in Manchester with them. I don't know if they go either. Fucking Jesus, man. I don't really have an argument against Carl because he will do anything, but he just won't. The only argument I have against Carl is he, he won't do it because then what won't? It's like, why can't you just come up with me, Brad and Emma and that? Yeah. He doesn't have a problem with Brad and Emma and that, so... But Liam, for some reason, doesn't like them. Why? So I'm just like, whatever. Well, don't say anything to Emma. Oh, yeah, I don't well, want it to cause an active row, because I know it will. I but Liam Emma insists that she's a slut and she cheated on that, and I'm like, well, you know, no, she you didn't. You know Emma she... hates Liam anyway. I don't know if she's told you. I'm not surprised. <laughs> did just pretty much tell me. She doesn't like them lying. I'm just in the middle, I just... Mate, you're stuck in the middle between a rock and a hard place here. <laughs> yeah. I've known them a lot for longer, but Brad and Emma are just better friends to me, yeah. so... Yeah, that is fucking... that's bad, mate. That really is bad, you know, coming from the horse's mouth. Mm. Oh, 
Oh my god, this fucking hack. I think I need to come off this. I can't concentrate to save my life. <laughs> you sound a bit tired. I'm knackered. My voice is still <laughs> sore. Like, I had a really sore throat a couple yeah. of days ago, but it's just, it's still a bit rough. It's like it's taking My voice comes down a sore throat. I mean, today yeah. the weather's got freezing here. Like, really, really cold today. So. It's not in too bad here. Yeah, but I'm not being funny, you know how when Emma told me that, I actually hate Liam and Carl now? Like, you know, honestly, I don't like them, like, I don't want to talk to them. Mm. Oh, what were you There's so many for? things they do that piss me off. Yeah. They just have just dealt one or two games on League of Legends. It was like the other day, I was on the Xbox and then I was texting Emma and then I was like, oh, should we go on team, go on team speak? And then I was like, actually, should we just go on Skype? Because them lot will be on here, so we'll just end up moving down channels. So we might as well just go on Skype. Me out of habit, I accidentally connected to team speak, so I disconnected straight away and went on to Skype. Glad messaged me on Facebook, join then DC, what the fuck? So I'm like, accidentally. Came on, like, I'm going off soon. He was like, why are you on Skype then? I was like, I'm just talking to him for a bit before I go, and he's like, you're a bad fucking liar. I'm like, no, it's just that I don't see the point of coming on to you. And then apparently he got really pissed off with me and that, and because I was ignorant, I was like, no, I just don't see the point in coming on T-Speed. Because <laughs> I'll just come on, you'll insult me, we'll move down channels. You'll start annoying us by moving us around channels and stuff like yeah. you have done before if you're bored. That's bad, that is. <laughs> I, I'm over it, mate, to be fair. This is why, I don't take this the wrong way, but you know when I join and I see like Liam and Carl, it's mainly those two, Liam's just boring as fuck, yeah. but um, and I see those two, like I instantly move down, because I can't yeah. be able to talk to them. It's too cool. You know Dan, Dan's hopped on, he went for dinner about an hour ago, he's still not finished. Fuck, I thought I was really slow there. Yeah, that phone's good one. Yeah. We're going to really pick it up on Saturday, mate. I can't... You know, man, I know this is going to sound bad, but you know, I thought buying it for myself and giving it my old one. <laughs> <laughs> it's just such what a steal for he all playing? that. He's downloaded. He saw me play um, Battlefield 3. And all of a sudden... Oh, I want Battlefield 3 now. So he's installed that, but like I said, you know, it runs like dog shit on his computer. So, he's, he's had that computer for ages as well, though, you know, that AMD one. Oh, you 
leave there, Devin. Oh. I'm here. Matt's timed out. Nice internet again there, Matthew. One more girl after this. God, let me quick save before I do this. I'm probably going to get torched. How do you like your new job? Internet oh. cuts out. Yeah, I know, I know, mate. You disconnected a while back. How do you like your new job? Have you started properly yet? Good. Have you started in the office and you, you're doing it? No, I'm in Stockport doing the training at the moment. Um, like we're doing, we've been doing customer there. service. Because that's where the QA apprenticeships, we do the apprenticeship, that's where their office is in Stockport. Oh, wow. And we've got the tutor there teaching us. It's not too bad because I'll get are my fuel pay, back. Are they paying for the fuel? And we're still getting paid. Yeah, good yeah. stuff. Um, but like we've been doing a customer service module and that and tomorrow they said like I think it's next week um, we'll be stripping a PC down and looking at the parts well, and you that. know what to do then don't you? Yeah? So, sure you do yeah well obviously there's, when I sent you that picture on whatsapp there's labelling that motherboard yeah. and then today he gives us a sheet and writing down what each part was like, what's the CPU for, what's the what's the PCI slot for, what's an AGP slot for, yeah. and all that. And I was just like, this is easy. <laughs> AGP, mate, I'm not being funny. You know they've not been using. Yeah, like it's pounds, the old one, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. I think that's what you're trying to get at. What, what people not is. to get mixed up with. Yeah. You should you should have no, you know, reason to fail that at all, man. You need to revise yeah. as well. Hmm. I think I think the main part of it is that we'll be doing networks, networking because like it started going on to like um, firewire and USB yeah. speeds, you know, like speed data transfer speed and that stuff. If you want to be a smart ops, you can tell them about the new upcoming USB four whenever that launches. It's meant to be stupidly fast. I can't remember when that's coming out. Enough. Yeah, USB 3 isn't. You know, I don't even use USB 3. I have them on my computer, I've just not plugged them in because there's no need. It's up to like 4.8 gigabyte per second. I think so, yeah, speed. near enough 5 gig. Well, I think Between 2.5 and. USB 4 is going to be even fucking quicker. What's the point? <laughs> like, you know, even when I download Blu ray books at the next day, usually like a gig and a half, two gigs. It's not even. That takes about 15, 20 seconds to copy. Yeah. Oh, do you know anything about it? What's they called? HD capture card or anything like that? Matt? Do you know about those? Capture cards? Yeah. Not, not really. Uh, I don't I know how they work, to be honest. Yeah, you plug into your computer and I think you plug your like, PS3 into it or whatever, but fucking expensive. I was thinking of getting one because what I want to do is get another PS3. You know, and um, on stream play that. Last of Us. Yeah, and stream that, but fucking dead dear. Yeah. Oh, we're getting fibre. You know, walking back today. <laughs> I saw the open reach Fiber, van. Nice. Yeah. Saw the yeah. open reach van, two blokes in the back of it, everything dug up. Tell me you're getting fibre down. We are indeed, sir. We're putting the new cables in now. Excellent news. Why is it taking so long? <laughs> Apparently, you know, because Belper, all this stuff's really old, you know, all the guttering and everything. You know yeah. the tree roots, they broke in through all the pipes and started growing in the pipes, everything was blocked. Um <laughs> So, you know, they've unblocked that and that's why it's taking so long. You know, this is why I was whinging before. You know, Ripley, which is like the white trash central, they had it before us. Because we literally, you know, right. they unblock it. This is yeah. where they bound us together, Father. Makes sense. Thank God. I can't wait for that. <laughs> well, they're putting the lines in now, but we're not getting it till New Year, like February time, so another month or two. Yeah. Will you have to pay for it then, like, to have the better internet? Or you just get a free upgrade to it? Uh, I'm not sure to be fair. Hopefully a free upgrade. I'll try and, you know, ring talk, talk and sort some of that because they've been amazing help so far. Yeah. Like, we've got an amazing package we have. She was not meant to have a father, Delta. Yeah. 
She was to be an heir to my life's work. What well, um this is where they changed. The font provider are you with um, like your SIM card, what? Oh mate, well you know how Jewish I am, don't you? Died in this I room. use gift yeah. gaff, they're the cheapest ones I've found because it's like gift four P per text. Well this is the sick thing, you know you can buy <laughs> you know it's pay as you go. If you go on gift gaff yeah. and if you go on their package things you can buy a five pound top up bag and what that is is basically unlimited texts. 500 meg internet and say 60 minutes, which is for call, is basically for the text, but you're paying 5 quid for 30 days for unlimited texts. So it's like you have a 30 yeah. day contract, if that makes sense, which is pretty sick, but even I don't get that. I just get paid as you go, because yeah. I just use WhatsApp for everything. Yeah. Or you have to uh, get an. Um, I'm just thinking, I'll just pay as you uh, go. What's she like signal like? Uh, well, I'm buying a phone page ago and then I'm getting a sim con like the sim contract sort of thing. Shit, yeah, sorry, God, I know you got done then. Sorry, yeah, go on. What, and you want to know what's the best page you go provided? Well, you know, talk, uh, not talk, talk. Um, gift gaff is. Sorry, I was talking to then. Yeah, no. Gift gaff, gift gaff, piggybacks off O2. And I have perfect signal where I live, and I live in the middle of nowhere pretty much. Yeah, here, it's just because I've been with Orange and orange the signal swank in some places is just horrible. No, I have signal everywhere. But Orange is fucking abysmal. I left him years ago, overpriced, and I just literally half the place, half the places I didn't get signal to. Or didn't get a signal in, yeah. sorry. They were just shit and expensive from what I remember. There must have been a reason I left them. Daddy, right here. What time is it? Where Fucking out 11 o'clock, what the f- Oh, <laughs> no, I'm doing this, I'm going to bed, I'm so tired. Goodie bag. Oh, what? Hello? What's your goodie bag? Goodie bag, yeah, that's what I was on about. That's where you can pay, like, five quid for this, like, you know... Like, you just read them. You can buy, you can pay, pay as you go, so you buy five, five quid, and you know, four people pays. But then you've got all the yeah. other stuff. It's just because like I went on the front page and they had the Galaxy Note 3, which is what I want. Yeah. And they can, you can either buy it for 600 quid, or I can get it elsewhere for like 450. Mm. Or they, they said uh, it could pay more for 25 pounds. I was like, oh, that's actually quite cheap mm. for a good film, for a contract. Yeah. But then it's like, pay more for 25 quid plus 10 pounds, could you buy 35 pounds a month? I'm like, hang on a minute, that's not 25 a month. <laughs> And then it's saying the goodie bag's 500 minutes on when it's given it to me. Yeah, told you. Sick, isn't it? That's pay as you go, though. But that lasts for 30 yeah. days. Those goodie bags are all 30 days. He's getting touched here. One sec, mate. I'm... Let's have a look. 20 meg internet for 5 pen a month. Who's going to have 20 meg internet? 20 meg about internet. That's like one web page. <laughs> <laughs> they should not be putting, you know like limits on internet anymore in this day and age. I know. We it's have unlimited stupid, yeah. I don't I don't track how much internet I use, but I bet you I use probably like forty gig a month just streaming itself. So I barely download anything, <laughs> like I just stream family guy. Um Yeah. So I just go on Facebook mainly and then play Star so often, but I usually download on my life. I love how you have fiber to use Facebook. You need you know you need those pages to load in like 0.1 second, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not when I'm about about my 3G connection, I only use Facebook really, because I've only got 250 megabytes and all I can't really stream. If I had a decent amount of internet on it, I'd probably start streaming. To be honest, I think I want to try and get 4G, if I'm getting 4G compatible with one. It's just a bit expensive. Good God, man, the amount of big daddies here is ridiculous, now. <laughs> but with 4G, you have to. You can't get a 30 day rolling one, so I can't try it and then decide, oh, decide oh, I want to go to Gibga. I'll, so I'll help you in a minute. I've got to I'm, I'm, I'm streaming for this, but I mean, gift gaff sims are free. Yes, yeah, right. And then you can, you know, do the well, goodie bag. Yeah. Oh, how you doing? Uh, how you doing, Dylan? Sorry, man, I'm not checking chat. I'm playing off sleep. I'm coming off in a minute, mate. So, 
Yeah, I mean, see if you can connect to TS. If not, man, I don't know. I can't help you. I'd probably do that for twelve pound a month. Unlimited tax and internet, two yeah. fifty minutes. Like I said, I used to just get the five one mate, because that is a steal. You know, unlimited text. You you blow through text like yeah. there's no tomorrow, or I usually do. Yeah, I've always had unlimited text. The highest I've hit in one month is two thousand two hundred, I think. What? Were you texting like some dodgy <laughs> premium text line or something? <laughs> <laughs> No, it was, uh, there was a few months where it was like one person and not when I first met that Lucy. And then when I got with that Ned and I was texting her and Lucy and that's when it went up to two thousand two hundred. <laughs> I, I usually do about eight hundred now. Yeah. Oh god, I'm setting my own turret to light again. Fuck's <laughs> But uh, oh, it's funny, the uh, woman, woman from Alan just phoned me the other day, just like a survey and uh, asking about my contract and that, and then I was saying like, I'm looking at getting a new phone, <coughs> I want the Galaxy Note 3, and then she started being all like, oh, you, you want the Sony Xperia, it's the best phone on the market, I was just like, yeah, okay, you keep chatting shit. Not Sony you know Xperia is the best phone on the shows. market. You know, you know they've got probably loads of experience that no one's bought, they need to shift. Yeah. That's all it is. They're thinking you're fucking retarded. You know you're a pensioner, but you don't know that. Yeah. Just sit more of I even said to it, I want to get the Galaxy Note 3. See, that's one thing I hate as well. You know when I go in saying I want this and then try and sell me something else? I know yeah. what I want. Stop trying to sell me shit that I don't need. <laughs> this is why I'll never go on contract. It just pisses me off. You know, even when you just talk about it, that fucks me off. That does. Because I'm yeah. not being honest. It's in their best intentions to, you know, sell me whatever they've been told to sell. They're probably working on a commission as well. The rats. <laughs> you know, like sell X amount of these phones a month and get an extra bonus or whatever. Yeah. All I want to do before I get a phone now is go into a shop and I can, like, ask, can I have a hold of a Galaxy Note 3? Mm. Just see how good it is now. That phone, my god, man. <laughs> You'd be able to like, sleep <laughs> on it. It's big, I just want to make sure I can use it because that would be the worst thing to do after yeah. paying like 450 quid for it. It's not a bad phone though, it's just huge. It's a fucking massive phone, man. I thought, have yeah. you been, you know when you were I like big phones though. Well, what I was going to say is, you know how you lot go shopping, have you not been to phone shops and like, because usually they have them out on display here? I did, about, I think about a month ago, when Brad was getting him a phone case, I went in, they didn't, they didn't have the Note 3 out. I had to go with the Note 2, and that is slightly bigger. Yeah. Um, and I was alright with that, so. Yeah, one second. But they changed the shape a bit of the Note 3. Right. Mate, you were honestly right. I'm, I love this more than Bioshock, the first one. Like I said, the first Bioshock's got an amazing story. This has got an amazing story so far, but the mechanics are so much better. Honestly, this is the better one of the two, I think. But my mate Dan, um, I don't know if you've heard him, he's not on at the moment. He's still having his din dinner. He's been eating for an hour and a half or whatever. Um, he hates it. He watched <coughs> a video review a year ago or whenever this game came out, and someone said it was shit, and you know, he's like a sheep. Meh. He just says, wow, that was a really bad sound cheap then. <laughs> My voice. <laughs> My throat still hurts. <laughs> it's like a sheep with a cold. But yeah, you know, he's not seen or played this game, but instantly it's just shit. Because, you know, he's seen the reviews, and the reviews said it was shit. Man, I feel so sorry for him. It's such a fucking fun game, this is. But yeah, go on, mate. Yeah, sorry, mate. Go on. Crack on, uh... Um. <gasps> crack on rattling about... I was just saying that. I've used the Note 2 and that was alright, so... Mm, you put right, mate, I think it's... It's just to change the shape of the Note 3 a bit. Have they? What is it... What, how, how do you they change just, the shape they just of the made it standard? 
it's not as wide, but it's longer. If that makes sense. So, if anything, it'll be easier to hold, won't it? You just have to move your hand up and down more. Yeah, probably. It's just because I'm paying like 450 or 50, I don't want to just go and buy it without even having a go of it first. Yeah. I like so to go in a phone shop and say, like, I'm after to get buying in all three. Can I have a, can I have a quick go of it? it yeah. And they'd be thinking, oh, he's going to buy it off us for 600 quid, and then I'd be like, alright, thanks, I'm just going to go and order it off the internet for 150 <laughs> quid. <laughs> Mate, I tell you what, you know you're after a new phone? Wait till the January sales. Wait till then. I know they're not going yeah. to drop by my well, I've not got enough yet anyway. phones, but, you know, still. Like it's worth yeah. hanging oh, I around. I, I got paid at the end of December, so oh, I'll wait yeah. till then and oh, yeah, nice. see what my money's like. Man, I'm so glad I got this, I got this HTC One X. It's so nice. Mm. I don't know, you see, I yeah, think this is like the, the perfect one size screen for me personally. It's like 4.7 or 4.8 inches. It, it's, it's, it feels yeah. right in my hand now. Is put like the screen is 1280 by 720. I love how it's a high def screen. <laughs> you know, my mate's laptops are like 1280 by 720 and they're like 15 inch, you know, monitors. So, yeah, but anyway, yeah, I just love it, man. I love it. It's just the problem with this one is it's you can't take the back off. Um, and yeah, man's like that because man's similar sales. Oh, shit. One second, I've just set a big data. Like, I'm gonna get touched in a minute. Oh, god, oh, god, that went wrong. <laughs> that went really, really. Operations GTFO. I, I played most of Bioshock 1 just using the menu. I'm surprised you didn't finish it. I, I mean, personally, Bioshock I did. It's, I it's an finished amazing Bioshock 1 and 2, I've just not done bit different. Oh, you've done 1 and? Wow, congratulations. That's I've done 1 and 2, I just didn't do infinite. I think that's the first <laughs> game I've bought on the So, because I bought them right. Oh god, uh, this is going really, really fucking <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah, sorry you were saying I didn't hear anything then. You bought what? You bought um, Because I bought Bioshock 1 and 2 on the Xbox, I ended up playing them through and completing them. Uh, I mean, I thought that was sick. Did you have to force yourself though? Was that when you were starting to get bored with games or something? Or? No, I did not. Because I bought them when they came out and it was like 2000. Seven and two thousand nine on it or something. Yeah, quite old now. Old shots. game, really old game. Graphics were brilliant for the time. Though. Yeah. Mate, you think graphics were brilliant? I thought you knew that Outlast game. I told you to play that, that spooky one. Yeah. Mate, I've that is that, on yeah. Unreal Engine three. You know which majority of the games are on. Jesus Christ, that doesn't look like mm. an Unreal Engine game to me. No. Such a sick looking game. I wouldn't mind playing that again as well, that was a good game. See, this is the thing, I've got so many games to play, but, you know, I'll put like a little poll on my stream, I'll be doing Batman next. Arkham City, I think, yeah. I've, I've done Asylum, which was fucking amazing. Have you played Batman? I still not played that. Oh, man. I think, all joking aside, those you'll enjoy, man, this story's so good. The combat, all my days. Yeah. If you play it, play it with a 360 pad, though, if you can. I think it's meant yeah, to be I've got a I mean, I've played it with a 360 pad, it's meant to be like a better experience than a keyboard. Yeah. Wow, I'm full on cash already, fucking hell. God, I feel so bad for burning these alive. <laughs> mm. But then they start attacking me and then I just stop caring. Devon, you still there? Yeah. Right, Matt, you know you're starting to get like Devon, he's bored of everything. So Devon, what are you doing right now to help Matt out when he's bored? I just sit here and browse Reddit. Oh. Bored of Reddit. Oh, he's, he's bored of Reddit already. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, never mind. I'm probably alright now. Yeah. I, I thought, thought, I thought he could, the line. You know, I thought he could give you tips, but... Nothing you can do. It's been banned at work already. Has we it? went on it on Monday, uh, on our break, and yeah. it was up running. Went on it yesterday. This site is this site is now forbidden. I was like, what? Oh, nice. You got your phone. Yeah. Do you not get free Wi-Fi at your work? Yeah, well, we've got free Wi-Fi in there, so I just went on the phone and Reddit was working on their Wi-Fi. <laughs> by the way, I'm telling you now. You know how going back to my phone, you know, it's 1280 by 720. 
Oh my god, it's so good. Yeah. Web pages actually look normal. You know, my older one used to have to like slide yeah. around because the screen was too small. On this, it's like a perfect squealer. A squealer? Yeah. What? So, mate, I need to go to sleep. Sorry, I've got one of these fucking things chasing me again. Oh, I'm gonna go off now because I'm knackered. All right, I mate, went to bed at like 12 last night. Yeah. I was just knackered this morning, so. Yeah, see you tomorrow. Take it steady. I'll see you tomorrow. Come on, come on, I'm waiting, I'm waiting. Come on. Oh, hello! There we go. This is how overpowered this drill is. Hit him in the corner and just touch him where they should not be touched. And spam medkits. <laughs> I feel so cheap doing this. So, so cheap. Oh. <laughs> it's bad, isn't it? Honest to God, if you're ever thinking about playing this, get the drill, get all the upgrades, get all the tonics, and... It's game over. The only thing you have to do is pretty much just buy fuel for it because it uses so much. Shit! There we go, that's better. Oh god, tell me they've got. Oh shit, I'm gonna have to go to a different vending machine. One second. Right, I need to open that door. This is why I love doing as well. I won't be able to do it now. Oh no, wait, I can? Wow. I thought you needed fuel for that. Okay, never mind. Yeah, you know, imagine someone doing a speedrun of this, just doing this. Oh, never mind. No, you have to. I must have had a little bit. But, you know, dashing around everywhere. Hey, buddy. Hey, but oh, I love how they all gang up on me now. Oh, fuckers. Oh, I love to see, you know, my stats for the amount of big daddies I've killed here because this is just getting ridiculous now. They're fucking everywhere. And I still don't have any fuel. Where the hell is that vending machine? There. Excuse me. <laughs> oh, they never learn. Oh, hello. Look how much Adam I have. 1,180. I have no room to buy anything else. Might as well just buy everything. Still on enemies longer. Charge up to generate chain lightning. Ooh, electrical storm. Every bolt hits more than one foe. Charge up to blast them with a deadly storm. Put that there, even though I might use it. Worried about your future? Scout the situation before going ahead. Get the jump on your enemies <laughs> with a plasmid surprise. Yeah, Dylan, how come your team speak's not working, bud? I mean, I. Literally, you just have to download TeamSpeak 3 and put in the IP and pass in. I, I have no idea why it's not working for you. At least it goes 500. But this is the another stupid thing that got on my tits here. At first it went up to 600, now it goes up to 800, but it still doesn't go to 999. Oh, God. Master your future. 
use Scout to overcome enemies and hack security in complete safety. Oh, this one I might actually use just for the hacking bit. I've missed buying a, a slot somewhere, I think. Freeze your enemies. Shatter them into a thousand pieces. Freeze enemies for longer. Charge up and put them on ice. I'm sure it is, yeah. I'll give it you again after... I'll, I'll send you on Steam after I stop streaming, mate. Like I said, because... I'm not going to be much longer on this, I don't think. I'm knackered. Deep freeze enemies quickly. Charge up to shower foes with a devastating ice storm. Need a friend? Charge up to charm your enemies. Warning, not all friendships are made to last. <laughs> Need bigger friends? Charge up to get Big Daddy <laughs> on your side. Well, I think I'll, that's it. That'll do. I've gone spastic with that. And still the only thing I use is the flame one, because that's the best one. Look how quick the health goes down. There we go. I've got to say though, you know, this is a lot easier than the first Bioshock. You know, especially like I said, you know, when you pimp it out, I'm playing this on normal, and I think normal was a lot harder on the first one. Then again, you know, when you got that invisibility thing, which I have, you know, when you stand still for like 10 seconds or whatever, you get it now, you know, on this is Big Daddy, so it's stupidly OP. And I've made a cap gold again. Good God. Oh, I think I know why. I think I've got one of these scavenger perks where I just pick up a little bit extra every time. I think. Kidding me? What the? F <sighs> we'll get the wrong way. Oops. There's a booth somewhere around here with a broken window. If I remember right, I need to hack that. Oh, hello. Isn't, mate, there isn't another name, it's just the IP import. Use the frost plasmid. Okay, I'll give this a shot. God, man, I look like Ice Daddy now. physical and mental conditioning, and 
and suited her up with modified protector equipment of my design. The younger ones have dubbed her a big sister. Sadly, this is a stopgap. Between rogue splicers and the aging of the girls, we'll run out of viable little sisters soon. After that, the surface may be our only source. God, this story's so messed up, how Andrew... Uh... What the fuck? <laughs> okay. Uh... Launch Eclipse Eyes. I never use it. For fuck's sake. And that's overpowered. <laughs> Jesus, that's overpowered. It's like the world's longest stun lock there. My god. Right, let's GTFO. Am I close to completing this, by the way, guys? Can I do it within the next 20 minutes or something? Like, am I close to finishing it? Devin, can you hear me, by the way? I'm talking quiet because everyone's gone bad. Can you hear me alright? Yeah, I can hear you just fine. Do I sound like the white version of Barry White? I don't know. Oh my god. I don't know how Barry White sounds. Um, you're kidding me. You've never heard a Barry White song? No. You know, honestly, sometimes when I talk to you, I wonder if you've, like, you know, been released from Guantanamo Bay or something. Oh, for fuck's sake. day then guys because I'm off asleep. Finish this up tomorrow and I think I'll start on Batman as well. Thanks for watching and I'll, uh, I'll see you then. Get a little quick save on. Are you waiting for Dan, Devin? Or are you going off? Me? Mm, because you will probably come back on, you know. I'm just sitting here browsing Reddit. <laughs> I have nothing to do. Oh man, yeah I mean I'm going off, I'm, I'm going to bed but I mean are you waiting for Dan on here? I'm gonna go off. Alright man, I'll see you tomorrow, take it steady. Dylan, I'll send you the Adios. IP stuff now.